Succulent channel here at Gracefully Rachel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how I make ramen soup. And no, it is not the cup of soup, the uh, marushan. It is a ramen noodle, but it's gluten-free because I'm gluten-free and I don't have a choice. So this is the gluten-free ramen noodle that I use. It's made out of rice and I get this at Costco. So far, that's the only place that I've seen it and I love it. Don't you know that um, when you have no choice but to be gluten-free, of course they're gonna open up restaurants and and that's like the popular item a spicy noodle i love that stuff but it's pretty hard when you are gluten-free so anyhow when i saw this um food item at costco i was all on that and this is a millet and brown rice noodle I already have my water boiling in my little saucepan and I'm going to show you the stuff that I use to make it just like or probably maybe even better than those ramen soups out there. So I'll go ahead and show you what I'm doing. So you see I have the water boiling already. It is not very high, kind of high, but nonetheless I have the water ready. This is what it looks like the noodle and it's gonna go in there package says about three minutes and yeah basically it's it's done pretty pretty quickly um the water when when i see that it's you know getting ready what i do is separate it with the fork so i'll show you that in a sec okay so now the noodles are done three minutes seriously it was three minutes I just use my fork to get out all the noodles and then I put some caldo or as you would say the broth of the noodle in there so I can have some broth in my soup. Okay so the next item I'm going to use to put in my soup is this chili paste. I love this hot chili paste. I like hot food. so. Oh, measure but I already know that I do about a tablespoon and a half of that and then good old sriracha yep gotta have that spice I just squirt a little bit in there and then next is because it is gluten-free I have some gluten-free soy sauce so I use some of that, so a couple drops, some generous drops in there. And next is bullion, chicken bullion, or in Spanish, consume. I use a little bit of that for some flavor. Just sprinkle some in. It's probably like a teaspoon and a half. And last but not least is my lime. I don't know, but I just love having all the soups I use with lime. That's just how I do it. Squeeze a half of a lime in there. Now, you know, in uh, the Marushan and the cup of soups, they already have the packet ready for you. So I have to make my own. And there it is. I have my spoon that I use and my fork for my noodles. And that's it. Pretty simple, huh? Um, it just, it tastes so good. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm about to enjoy my soup, my sopita, a uh, hot kind. And um, if you like this video or if you wanna see me make something else that's gluten-free, um, go ahead and shoot me a comment down below and if you haven't subscribed yet go ahead and subscribe to my channel I would appreciate that and if you like this video click the thumbs up like this video I would appreciate that too 
And if you want to share this video, be my guest. Share away. And I'll let you go. You guys have a blessed day. See you next time on my next video. Bye.